he's one of the faces of Dragon's Den, the TV show where entrepreneurs pitch an idea to grisly old hands who know the trade. And all of that has given James Kahn an idea of his own. He reckons small and medium businesses are the way out of Britain's downturn. Many of those, of course, are Asian-run. This country's got 4.9 million businesses, SME businesses. All you need is each of those companies to hire one person, and we would eradicate unemployment. But if you look at generally most kind of ethnic minorities, they tend to find the concept of entrepreneurship and enterprise something that they really strive and, and they drive for. And I think we probably do have more entrepreneurs within ethnic backgrounds than probably as a percentage of their population. Whether this works or not depends on how optimistic small businesses feel about the future. Businesses like the one Amjad Mahmood runs in Acton. Every afternoon at four o'clock, the machines go on that mix the dough, that makes the bread. He sells to 300 shops and supermarkets around London. Smaller independent places, cafes, pubs, wherever there's market for crusty bread business or rolls of French sticks, sandwich makers, we supply people like them. What were your kind of costs a year ago compared to now? I think the cost has gone up by about 15%. That includes the flour, the packaging, fuel costs as well. So 15 to 20% has gone up. Amjad's got 20 employees at the moment. His headcount is one of the biggest factors in the money he makes. If the sales go up, we gain because we manage with the same number of staff. If the sales go down, then we lose out because we can't really reduce staff because a man has to be at the end of the conveyor, so we can't really take him out. So does he think James Kahn's idea is a goer? Well, as far as James Kahn is concerned, I'm sure he can afford it, but we certainly can't. The ingredient cost and the raw materials have gone up and we've had to absorb them. He would, though, consider it. Having said that, if it helps the country, if it helps the economy, business of my size, I would be prepared to take another part-timer on, but not certainly not a full-time staff because it wouldn't be feasible for me. It, it might do more bad than good. Things are tough for businesses around the country. Small businesses are no exception. For them to be able to bring in James Kahn's idea, they'd need to have confidence about the future. And that's one thing they don't all have.